What's going on? How y'all doing? So, this video going to be about Trey Young. Like, he got spat on by the New York fans last night. And I did a video about Russell Westbrook. And I saw Metal World Peace on uh, Undisputed talking about it. Um, And I'm going to say this. We're still in the middle of COVID. There's still a pandemic going. It ain't over. You know, it's subsided quite a bit for now. But it ain't over. Still have the population haven't got jabs you don't know. But saliva can kill. It can travel. If Adam Silver has any kind of spine, and I, I question him because remember he had the All-Star game in Atlanta a few months ago and LeBron James and some people were not exactly happy about having an All-Star game when vaccines weren't even fully uh, rolled out to bless the population and you had one, let alone two. But anyway, if Adam Silver has any kind of spine, he'll say this. He'll say, if in any another incident happens to another player, we will either limit the fans to a thousand or less or no fans. You have to set some kind of precedent and some example. A lot of these fans is racist and drunk. And when I say that, I ain't holding nothing back. The predominantly white fans who see black players and they see them for entertainment purposes have no respect. It's no different than the malice in the palace when the former um, Ron Artest now met a world peace. Stephen Jackson and others got up there, got things thrown at them, etc. It's no different. No different. You see, a lot of these fans, because they think they pay a lot of money, they can talk any way, act any kind of way, and do whatever they want. You got to have somebody that's the commissioner needs to set some president and say, look, we're still uh, dealing with this pandemic. You can still catch cases. Mask up if you're not. And you do something like this. We will either limit it to a thousand or no fans. That's what you need to do. But I don't think he got the, the gut. I don't think he has the guts to do that because he's about that bag, you know. But you got to protect them. You got to protect the players. This can't go on. We're still just coming to pandemic. You just now open up your building. And this is the second night of the first back-to-back -back with fans, and this what happens? No. Because, see, they may not think much of Russell Westbrook, powers it be, but Trey Young is their future. And don't let nothing happen to a future meal ticket that can sell seats and eyeballs. Something like this happen. And don't let, God for don't let Trey Young get COVID or something tragic happen, and you didn't protect because that's going to be on your conscience. But more importantly, it's going to come out your wallet. Your bag will be ripped. Anyway, that's my thoughts and takes about Trey Young getting spat on by the New York basketball fans. Something need to be done, Adam Silver. Please give me your thoughts and your takes. If you like, the subscribe, or welcome thoughts and comments. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. And I do respond. Thank you. And uh, NBA Commission, you need to do something about this. Because I'd give them an ultimatum. If anything like this happens again, especially during this postseason and until we get to the season, thousand fans or less or no fans at all. Gotta come with an ultimatum. I'm out.